I have brand new and I have old. What you're looking at here is a brand new under 50 mile GT3 paint to sample that's here to get protected. On my left, I have 1987 Porsche that's well loved with over 130,000 miles. And as you can see, it wasn't properly protected when it was brand new. If you're looking for a performance vehicle, this is the car. But as much as they've solved driving performance, air draft, suspension, everything like that, they haven't figured out how to make a paint that doesn't get damaged. This car has under 50 miles on it and already has several rock chips throughout the front end. So the customer wants to preserve it and have those things stop. And that's why it's here to get what we call the ultimate armor. It's an invisible protection that covers every surface of the exterior of the vehicle. We're going to apply a clear bra to the front to stop flying rocks and impact. And then we're gonna apply a ceramic coating to the remainder of the vehicle, as well as on top of the clear bra, including the wheels, the plastics, the glass, and this car should look new, even when well-driven and driven hard for many, many decades to come. We're about to put on the Kavacha ceramic coated PPF onto the brand new GT3 so that we can show you some demo characteristics of how amazing the film is to protect the modern vehicle as well. You can see in this demo just how malleable the film is and how it contours to every curve of the modern car. On this one too, you can immediately see the gloss of the film, how it adds gloss even to a brand new, beautiful, already glossy vehicle. Some other amazing characteristics about the film, it has a really special top coat. So the top coat is infused with a ceramic coating, so it has hydrophobic qualities much like Ceramic Pro 9H and Ceramic Pro Top Coat, and it also has a self-healing ability that works when you introduce heat. So it could be heat from the sun, or heat from a heat gun, or in this case, you'll see heat from water. So instantly there, I can see the scratches are almost completely gone. I also saw that whew, the water just wisped away from the film in a way that it didn't immediately do on the paint. And if we did this again, worst case scenario, what you have here is a protective barrier that should it get damaged beyond repair, you could simply peel it off, leaving behind bare, perfect paint. So if you're lucky enough to get your hands on one of these cars or even own it, you'll see a change on the rear end. In the past, the air-cooled cars you know, had the vents um, and it was a direct way for the oxygen and air to get into the engine. But if you also notice on those cars, and we'll take a look at the one that we have here, that those plastic pieces tend to age and look older than the rest of the car more quickly. This one, whether it's good or bad, you can't even access the engine to even look at it if you wanted to admire it. But you do have this cool trap door that opens up that means you can add oil or um, <laughs> coolant. It's definitely coolant. Uh, <laughs> and, uh, but that's the only access you have to the engine. With this vehicle here, we will go ahead and protect these plastics with the Ceramic Pro coating to ensure that they don't age or oxidize and suffer the same fate as the classic that we have here. I wanna take you back to the future, to 1987 when this car was born. So this was really state-of-the-art technology and a real driver's car that people could really take out and perform and have fun in, but also, honestly, drive it on a regular basis, even daily drive it. As you can see, though, what 34 years will do to a vehicle when it didn't have the type of protection we have now. If you come in and take a close look at this, you're going to see they did protect the front end with the leather bra. And you can see it prevented a lot of oxidation and there's obviously less scratches and less chips here than there is on the rest of the hood. But I actually have a feeling that this leather bra caused this paint damage here by having some trapped moisture. Now that doesn't mean that this car wasn't well loved. This is an enthusiast owned vehicle and the owner of this car to this point didn't even know that these type of restorative uh, services existed and that these types of protection op options existed. So what makes this product unique is it's the most technologically advanced paint protection film on the market. Not only is it infused with our ceramic coating on the exterior to make it look amazing, stay cleaner longer, avoid stains, 
It also has a self-healing uh, property, but also on the back side is nanotechnology infused material also that helps fill and hide years of damage and neglect. It basically hid all of the scratches and swirls, basically restored the paint. So not only does it have protective qualities, but because of the nanotechnology underneath the film, you can actually fill and hide most of the previous damage. So now we're gonna be begin the paint correction process of removing these rids, which is random isolated defects and scratches to make the paint glossy, black, fresh, almost new. So what I'm about to apply is Ceramic Pro 9H. This is our flagship product based on ceramic nanotechnology. It's gonna permeate into the pores, make the actual paint harder, um, fill the pores permanently so that it remains slick, has a deep gloss that can't be achieved through any other type of protection. And then ultimately we'll follow it up with a top coat to give it that true hardness and slickness. This is what it looks like. She's looking pretty shiny. <laughs> so while it's not perfect over here either, as I remove the tape, you're gonna see a really, really dramatic effect and dramatic difference between the uncorrected piece and the totally corrected piece. And unlike a wax or a sealant that you may be familiar with, with, uh, with your vehicles, this is permanent, meaning if you wash the car, um, if it drive it through a rain, whatever, uh, this will not go back to this. This is corrected and now protected. 